Hey guys, Lizard Freak 7 here, and today we are going to do a how-to video. Um, you know, this would be a series of many, but I will talk about some mini games in Minecraft that um you might need to know. Right now, it's uh we're in Shadow Craft, so if you want to join the server, why not? Um, the IP will be in the description. But this is for mini games. So, uh, first thing I sh I'm going to talk about is um basically all the mini games you can find. Then I'm going to do factions, KPVP, parkour, uh, Skywars, Skyblock, um, Prison when it's out, creative, survival, Hunger Games, and this is going to do mini games. So yeah, tons of stuff that I will talk about, but this is our first. So this is just going to be a quick thing about how to do all these mini games. First thing I'm going to talk about, I'll start at TNT Run. So, um, basically, TNT Run is a minigame um, where I need to get another player. Um, okay, so the Spock joins. So, um, yeah. This is what we do in uh, TNT Run. Uh, you have to run around until and the floor that you step on uh, disappears. So, if you fall, I mean, yeah, if you, you'll, you can fall into spaces as fast as you can go is a little walk. But that's kind of risky because if you slow down one little bit, you will, um, if you slow down a little bit, you will fall. So I'm just going to do as much as I can, um, over here. And let's get to the bottom. Oh god, that is the bottom. <laughs> um, uh, w at the bottom, if you lose, you're going to be in, uh, you're going to lose. You're going to be in lava and you lose the game. You're, um thing is to your your what you're trying to do is stay on the platform as long as you can so let's go to the next mini game um let's go spleef uh this game is spleef where you um have snow covered on the ground and you have to destroy it with a, a diamond shovel you can it, what you're trying to do is get rid of the ground below you. Um, uh, yeah, you're just trying to get rid of the ground below the other person and knock them down until, you know, you win. So I'll show you once it starts. Let us do this. Okay, see? Ground below you. And then you just try to um, destroy the block below the other person. Um, and they obviously have the same shovel. I might try as hard as I can, so I'll be quiet in try hard mode. Yes, see how you got them down? Usually there's more players and they're gonna start, you know, getting each other out. But for right now, it's just um, me and him. So, let's go. <laughs> Final round. And that's it. That's how it is. So that's Bleef. Let's end the game. Okay. That's Bleef. Next we're going to do Spleg. Spleg is the same thing as Spleef. Shoot. Um. Spleg. Not you. Okay, he's already in it. Uh, so this is a game, it's the same thing as Spleef, but you have something that shoots eggs, and wherever the let eggs land is where, you know, the ground disappears. So, here are a few of the arenas we have here. There's obviously some more. But map 2, I believe, is that one. So, yeah. Let's do it. So I think it is, uh, Spleef, or Spleg, Dart, 2. I haven't done this in a while. Yep, Splag spark, Start 2. You start the game, and you need more than one player, obviously. And, yeah, that's basically what you do right here. And, um, yeah. And this, compared to Splag, I mean Spleef, this game, you can actually destroy people below you. So I'm going to shoot, shoot down, because this is really boring. And let's go. Um, uh, the best thing you can do is just try to shift sometimes. 
Because if you're moving and you accidentally fall into a hole, you're you're dead. Oh shoot! I just fell to my death. Oh wait! I just I just failed at parkour. Um. Yeah. So that is. I'm in the floor. That is um spike. Next is paint wars. Awesome. Oh, and thank you, that's back for joining me while I do this. So this is paint wars. Um, basically, what you do here, I think it's paint. Paint wars start to start the game, I believe. Oh, PW. I haven't done this in a while. PW start. PW start one. Yes. Um, that's how you start the first arena. And so on. Um, I don't think he's here. So basically what you're doing is um, running around and you're trying to get your color to the bottom of the floor. And every once in a while there will be a power-up. So let's find a power-up. There it is. There'll be a power-up on the floor, followed by a firework explosion. I don't think you can hear audio right now, but that's how you do it. And you'll get a power-up. This is advanced darkness. Everyone else has blindness for a while. That's what each power-up does, and you basically just cover the whole arena in your color. So, this is, like, no... Yeah, see, my power-up faded away. This is absolutely no use, because no one else is in the arena with me. That because I didn't advertise it or anything. So this is Paint Wars. I have never covered it to 100%, so I want to do it. Because, you know... Oh, there's another There's another power-up. Broken power-up. That's whenever one of you has, like, the nausea. And I think, like, the best way you can play is in, F in F5 mode, because you will... Like, be able to see power-ups that happen behind you and stuff like that. Immortal color power-up. I forget what that does. Like I said, I haven't played in a while, but, um, big blob power-up. Like I said, that's for how you do it, and, um, I think that's it. So, that is Paint Wars, so I need to get this last power-up. Speed power-up. So yeah, there's tons of power-ups you could do, and it's really cool. PW, leave. Uh, leave the arena. Uh, then you do Color Shuffle. This is a game where you have to run to the color and basically just try to go as much as you can. So be right back when the round starts. And here we go. See, um, the color of wool will be in your hand, and you have to run to the certain color. Right now, I believe I have game mode 1 on, because I am a, um, sorry, I'm taking a long time, I'm talking, uh, because I am an up person, and there's ice below you, so it's kind of hard to move, uh, and the XP bar on the bottom, it shows you how much time you have left, and you have to go to the color on the floor of, um, where you have to go to. So I'll go to at least round 10, and then I'll um, fall, and if you fall, the round is over, but if, um, if, uh, like, try to beat round 24, that's how high I got to, and it gets harder every single time. So that's basically what, um, this is the same one. This is basically what Color Shuffle is. It's actually a pretty di addicting, fun game. And, uh... Let us find purple. It's kind of hard to tell the difference between purple and magenta, because magenta is just a little bit brighter, and it's really hard. Sorry. Oh god, I'm not paying attention. Whee! I never knew I could do that. Blue. I shall jump to this one. Sometimes they can be more than one, and it's pretty cool. So, um... Yeah. See, and yes, the colors do change sometimes, so... 
Let's go. Um, over here. Jump. And sometimes people go like this and jump to the other one, which is pretty cool. Oh, that was, this is round 10. So I'll get to round 10 and jump over. See, some people choose that one that's pink, but I'll fall down, showing that's the end. And you die and go back and you lose. Um, the other player go continues to go on. And yeah, good luck with color shuffle. It's pretty fun. Um, this one is paintball. I will wait for my assistant to get out of color shuffle. Be back, guys. Okay, he is um, here. So basically, what paintball is is you get snowballs and you shoot them at the other player. It's actually pretty fun, and that's what basically all you do. Sorry, my mouth is a little dry this time, but I will get some water later. So um, yeah, be back when the round starts in about thirty-seven seconds. And let us go. Let us do this thing. And let's go. See so you get. Oh my gosh, someone died here. Where is he? Die. So basically, you get a few things and you shoot shoot them and they die. And um, yeah, the best wins and you have a lot of seconds to do this. Where is he? Ah, uh, he killed me. So it only takes a few things for people to die. And you spawn in random areas. So, yeah. That's that. Oh, and you wear the color of wool on your head. So let's find the best block, kill him one more time, and end the round. Let's actually do this whole round, because why not? Yes, I was almost dead. I'm trying my hardest net right now. It's pretty easy for you to die. And they can spawn in random spots, so it's kind of scary. I died. That was a pretty good shot on his part. Die. Oh, I was spawned right next to him. God, I'm spawning right next to him now. Wait, where is he? Die. No, I'm failing. One more time. One more time. Where'd he go? Die. Oh, that was close. I'm running away now because it's really hard knowing, not knowing where they're going to spawn next. But I am guessing that he will spawn way over here. Ah, that was a good shot. I think he'll win this round. Um, Good, get, good job to the best Bach. Uh, we kill each other. Yeah, he won. So good job. And that's it. So yes, um, that is that. That is where is it? Paid ball. This is capture the flag. It's basically the same thing as real life capture the flag. Um, and uh, you're just trying to get the other person to the other person's uh, base and capture their wool and bring it back to your base. So, um, without getting killed, of course. So we are back, and I will show. And here we go. So basically what I'm um, trying for here is on along the sides, here's a little shortcut. You can run over here. Um, oh god, he's about to kill me. You have to get to the other person's base because right now I'm red. Get their wool. Run back without them killing me. So, oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. So I am going to kill him and hopefully he dies. He has failed. Um, I have failed, really. I'm going to run back and take the flag and put my flag back there. Because I have the time. And bam. What? <laughs> oh yeah, that is the glitch in here. Take it back. Take it back. Take it back. This is the glitch of this, but um, other servers, um, this will not be the glitch. And, um, yeah. Oh, yeah, I can't take that off. Ocean of healing. I really should bring, eat, or drink the potion of healing, but I am not very smart sometimes. There we go. 
and we have it back. Oh, red has something. So this is a potion of regeneration and potion of healing. And I will splash the potion of harming of harming on him. There we go. And let's kill him. I have regeneration. You cannot defeat me. No, he probably will, but I am not doing very well, am I? No, I'm not. Oh, no, he has my thing. The good thing is I spawn right here. God, where was my sword? There we go. Without my regeneration, I look good at doing this. Oh, God, I'm failing. There we go. So I'm going to run over and get my regeneration. And um, jump over here. And, um, yeah, let's hopefully he doesn't die. But if, please don't tell me he's on my tail. I honestly cannot tell. He is not. I'm going to try to meet him in the middle, and if not, just run away, basically. I want to get to- oh god, oh, I'm in shift. <laughs> I'm going to run away now, because I want to get away from you. I don't want to die. Thank you for giving me a boost, even though I'm ruining the boost. And... Home. God, I'm failing at this. Respawn, get to this, and kill him, because he I believe he still has my flag. And I cannot get over this. So yeah, this is basically capture the flag. Um. So I'm going to do, I think it's CTF leave. Yes, it is. Um, uh, that's capture the flag. This is Mob Arena. Uh, right now it's on my, on my server. It's getting fixed, so it doesn't have too much. And you just go like this. You click on this, and um, you battle mobs and all that. And you have different waves and all that. But right now it's not working right now, so I'm just going to do MA leave. You can't use that command in the arena. MS leave, MA leave. There we go. That is Mom Arena. Here is Flappy Bird. You hold the feather. I like to go on F5. And um, you play Flappy Bird in this person in person view. So, um, yeah, uh, not many servers have this, so please come and join ours. Um, again, the IP will be in the description. I need to use my keyboard for this because I usually use a controller. I've never done this much because I got too annoyed. So. And. What? That was totally out. Um. Come on. I just want to get it to three. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I am failing. That's for sure. I got to a much better. One, two, three, and I failed this one, but I got three, so you could command, um, flappy leave. Let me get to my non-game mode one, so, command, I think it's flappy leave. Yes, it is flappy leave, and I am dying. Oh yeah, because I have to do that. And that is Flappy Bird. Here is the walls. I don't want to get to a whole thing. But the walls is where you go to an arena. The floor, there's walls put up. There is stuff in, ch in a chest. And you get resources, build armor, and get um, weapons. And once time is up, which is normally like 20 minutes, I believe, the walls will go down and you can have an all-out battle with the other players. So it is a pretty fun game. Go have fun. And yeah. Here is murder. Uh, um, wait, be right back. Okay, guys. So uh, the best mark's not here. And um, uh, I'll be honest. Someone else imported this game into the server. And I have never played it. So I have no idea what it is. Um, but just try to play it. It's pretty cool. 
if you have fun in other servers, um, have fun playing it. And I accidentally did that. Have fun playing it. And, um, that's basically all I have to say with murder. Um, Connect 4 is the classic game of Connect 4 where you play with another character and